five things I would never do as a dermatologist, part four. One, I would never trust makeup with SPF to be my primary and sole form of sun protection. We just simply don't apply a thick enough layer to get that full SPF benefit. So always remember, put on your sunscreen first and then your makeup with SPF on top of that as an adjunct, not your primary. Number two, I will never inhale while applying spray sunscreen. I mean, hold your breath if you're putting this on. And especially if you're putting it on your children, spray the sunscreen on your hands and then pat it on their faces because you don't want them inhaling and sniffing in all that sunscreen deep into their lungs either. Number three, I will never go anywhere without Vaseline. I know I'm obsessed. I'm not even sponsored by them. I wish they would because I go everywhere with it. It's great for your lips. You can use it for slugging and select areas around your face. And it's really good for burns and scrapes and wounds. And I use it for my son's eczema and any you know cuts and things that he might get all day long. Number four, I never go outside without sunglasses. And the reason for that is simple. I don't wanna squint in direct sunlight because the squinting causes wrinkling around my eyes. And that area is super hard to treat. You know, Botox can only do so much. And you're also protecting your eyes against cataract formation too. Okay, last but not least, and this is kind of a niche one, I will never use hotel shampoos. Like I will always check the ingredients because a lot of them contain sodium lauryl sulfate and that will totally strip my hair of its color. And I mean, I paid a lot for this, so I'm not about to let some hotel shampoo ruin this. Like and comment for part five.